happy Friday, happy launch day. Um, per usual, I'm late coming onto the show. Um, you guys are already on, so let's see who's on. Um, Sarah, can you make my view? I don't see any comments. It gets real short. I want to see. I want to see what they're saying. Okay, I see Debbie. Good morning from Denver, Debbie. You guys, today is um. It is a very exciting day here today for several reasons and weekend here. One, our sample sales this weekend. Two, our VIP um, meet and greet is this evening. Unfortunately, this is our third day, a third launch in a row that it's yucky, rainy, cloudy, and humid. So I was not going to fight the humidity today. <laughs> so you get it. Okay. Wendy's on. Happy Friday from Indiana. Brittany from, Brittany from Indiana too. Two from Indiana. Kristen, Kristen from Chicago area. Krista... Good morning from Michigan. Okay, so launch day, and it ended up being a really big launch today. So that's one thing that's exciting. Two, sample sales tomorrow. Anyone on that's coming to our sample sale tomorrow? Um, 9 a.m., rain or shine, doors open to the public. We actually are in doors inside the warehouse this year. So bring an umbrella for if you're waiting in line outside. Um, what? Why does it rain every time I have sample sales? I need someone to answer that. I feel like every time it rains when I have sample sales. But it's indoors, so once you do get in from the line, get there early, um, then you'll be in, inside our warehouse area for the sample sale. The VIP meet and greet is tonight at the Oasis, and the Oasis is known for its like phenomenal views off of Lake Travis. And it's raining and cloudy. So, but it doesn't matter. We get to meet. I get to meet a lot of you. Hopefully some of you are on. I don't know. Maybe you're traveling here. I don't know. Some maybe some are on. But I get to meet some of you tonight. I get to see some of you at the sample sale tomorrow. Today's a big launch day. Of course, I was late to the launch. So, um, big launch day. Let's go ahead and get started. Oh, final thing. Oh, my gosh. We have a special guest, too. Special guest here today making a special appearance during our um, live today. And I haven't even gotten to say hi. Higher than that. That's how behind I've been running this morning. So you'll see them when they walk on the camera and you'll see me say hi to them the first time today. So um, it's exciting. It's very exciting. Let's get started because um, like I said, you guys have said it since the beginning. I say it every time. We are just launching to you what we can get to you as soon as it gets here. We have thrown our uh, merchandising plan out the window again, like we did for um, COVID last year. Um, and we just are getting you the product. So luckily this launch rounded out to be a big, big one. Actually, um, it was actually not going to be very big, but we got a lot of product in last second yesterday. So, okay. Spring dream dress. We're just, I'm going to roll guys. I'm going to talk fast because I know you're going to have lots of questions about a lot of things. Plus our special guests. So, um, spring dream dress. Hold on. Let me back way up. Um, we did this dress. Gosh, was it last year or two years ago? Do you guys even remember two years ago? the spring dream dress, um, and you guys asked for it back. So our team brought a new um, striped version in this year. Now here, um, here's what the spring dream dress is. It's our stretchy, very stretchy, perfect pocket team material. Um, it has a high, low hemline, which is just really flattering, okay? Great for spring going into summer, and um, hits above the knees there in the front, a little bit longer in the back. It does have pockets, okay? This one's got the pockets. You guys have told me in the last five, you said, Melissa, put pockets in everything. This one has the pockets. They are tacked forward, okay? So they do, they won't uh, swing around to the side of your hip or to your back, which is very helpful that they are tacked forward and stay forward. Nice, um, kind of a short, nice, short flattering sleeve fitted down through the bust a little bit longer um, or a little bit, wider it comes out through the hip and the waistline. So super, super flattering. This is just really, really easy to throw on. I mean, you can throw it on with a cardi over it. You could throw it on with a, um, a jacket over it. You can layer this. We wanted to give you a gray and white stripe, which is what this one is. Heather gray and um, ivory stripe just to be that go to layer this up you can do floral scarves with it you could do lots of jewelry with it you can pull out the colors in what you're accessorizing so real easy neutral so you can also do um very easy with a sandal very easy with a flip-flop very easy with a sneaker you could do a sneaker and a ball cap with this and make it kind of look sporty um oh no they say i don't have sound no, we're, good. we're good okay okay uh, 
I still said someone I heard her and I don't hear her again. I hope you guys can hear me because we have a lot to talk about. Anyway, fit is same as the previous year. If you have a spring dream, if you have the, the spring dream dress, remember it was like red and navy. Amanda just wore it yesterday um, and had yellow stripes in it. Do your same size. We did slightly make two changes. We loosened the arm opening the sleeve a little bit. Okay, right here just a little bit and we did let out the bust just a tiny tiny bit we didn't make any other changes than that the neckline is the same the body is the same the pockets are the same so I would stay in your size if you have the spring dream just before I would stay in your same size as this we just took your comments and your feedback um, that some of you wanted a little bit looser of a sleeve not as tight of a bust and we just made those changes slightly okay Trisha Great question. This is not too short for a baby bump. Shelly is on vacation. Our baby bump is on vacation, but um, it looks super, super cute. And there's room in the body here, okay? Because we did a flowy body. So this one, like our dress um, that released a, a couple weeks ago, our tank version, was more slender through the body than what this one is, okay? This one is um, fitted through the bust, but it does give you a little bit more room and flow in your normal size through the hip and the waist. If you're more narrow, not busty, if you're more narrow, straight body frame, less curvy, you probably could size down in this. I would stay in your normal size if you've got curves though, okay? Wait, who's, <laughs> why is someone saying, okay, someone's replying to Ashley about having a taco gut and it looks fine. I don't know, I just got taco gut. Um, that's what's great about this one, it hides. This one is not uh, slender through the waistline here. So yes, you can get away with the taco gut um, in the tummy area in this one. Just flowy, easy, throw on, You picnic, I don't know, walk with your kids, you can dress it up as equally as, as equally too, okay? Oh my gosh, I don't know how I just got that. Rita, yes, it is the perfect pocket tee material. No, it is not see-through. And it is that, um, the tonal stripe on there. Okay, let's bring some people out in this one. Let's see, Sophia is in a small in this one, right? You guys, I was scrambling this morning, so <laughs> trying to bring it all together for you guys on the live. All right, Sophia in small in this one. Okay, so feel free to make this as dressy or as sporty as you want it. That's why we gave you this neutral palette to start with, okay, with a stripe. You can go florals, you can put, you you can do floral scarves, you can do wraps, you can do things like that, that just let the stripe, stripe just kind of be a neutral. That's what's so great about a neutral, or in a stripe, is that you can play it up with color. So you can tie something around the waist, she could go with sneakers here and make this super sporty and put a like a ball cap on with it and make it sporty, or you can dress it up. So just let it kind of be its neutral in that way, okay? Small, and yes. you? Small. Small and Sophia. Hey Rhonda, everything I'm talking about today is on our website, graceandlace.com. Click on new um, and everything I'm talking about today is our new items that are launching today. And when you click on the product, it will show you the price and you can check out that way. Okay. Okay. Next is Ash. This is what I was saying. See how you can just throw a jacket on this. You could throw a cardi on with this. Let it be a layer, a real basic layer underneath whatever you want to put up on top or just leave it alone and throw some great jewelry on it. Okay, straight. Flip flop, casual style. Okay, easy. Yes, the it is a high low star, style. Um, Kelly, hopefully you can see that on the girls and you can see it here with the cut. I'm gonna try to pull it apart because I know you can't see the stripe. See the high low front? So the front will hit above your knee here and the back will go much longer, okay? Ash looks great. Cheryl, thank you. She does. Okay. And who else? Natalie is in this in her normal size large. And all right, here, so they're just going to do what I, I was saying. Throw on a floral scarf, give yourself a little necklace, throw on a sandal, and then you have like a dressed up version of this dress. Okay. So dress down, dress up, whichever you prefer. She is, and then here's where that pocket, well, you saw her hands in her pocket. So um, you can see those hips just kind of right at the hips and they will flow forward, fall forward, okay? All right, Jackie, who were you wondering? Were you wondering if um, Sophia can wear the extra small? I would say Sophia can wear the extra small. Sophia? <laughs> oh, the pockets. Um, so I know Sophia can wear the extra small, actually, and, and I actually thought she would come out, <laughs> come out in the extra small, but she chose the small. So Sophia, you can wear the extra small, right? I can. Yeah, she can. Sophia's more narrow then I am through here and she's a little bit more narrow than me in the hips 
and because it's just a flowy dress and stretchy, she could go down. Okay. Natalie is five eight. Mm -hmm. Natalie, is that right? Yes. Yes. Okay. Oh, oh sorry. You're fine. Right <laughs> okay. And Amanda's. I was taking. A, I was taking a break. Amanda's gonna come out. Hey, summer look here. Just really fun for summer. She threw on what her necklace is. Threw on a hat. Coming soon, you guys. These darn hats can't get here soon, <laughs> soon enough. Um. And then see how it just hits her, it hits below your knee a little bit? Like oh, right, right above. Just right above her knee, and you're 5'9". Five, 5'8". Five, eight eight. Five, eight. I'm going to turn to the left so we can see the length. Okay, and a little bit longer in the back. Really flattering, easy to put on, hides things that you want to hide, okay? Um, we didn't, Patricia, we did not make any changes in the length or in the width um, of the body from this year's style to the past, the um, past one. The only changes that we made was we opened up the sleeve a tiny bit and gave a little bit more room in the bust. We did not make any changes from there down or in the hemline. So it is exactly the same as previous in those, um, in the fit for those. Okay. Okay. Let's go to stripe. Oh, what I have on stripe floral tee. You guys, this one is a home freaking run okay <laughs> you, i wore it on and i wore it in my um oh my picture that i do for you guys to announce the live um but it it we we just elevated every tea that uh can even possibly exist in your closet um and gave it such an elevated style so Lindsay was the artist on this one and the creator and she did or designer Lindsay did such such a great job okay so talk about a way to elevate just a basic tee to throw a stripe and a floral combination together to give you just a really fun pop of pattern okay so this one has a heather gray stripe running all the way down it okay not too close together not too far apart just shows you that it's kind of just on you know not on a solid body and then the floral pattern runs all the way from the neckline down through the bust and then same on back okay so it's almost like the florals just kind of came down this way and then in normal grace and lace fashion we put all the fun spring colors in here so blushes and pinks and purples and corals and sagey colors in here pop of yellow um right here and then you guys saw i show you there's a little pop of purple um we do this because we want you to feel like you have a lot of things in your closet that um, you can wear with this one. Okay, so talk about such a great time. Although this is supposed to be here a month, a month ago, um, at least it's here now. But such a great way to kind of bring out the fun spring summery, you know, pop, but not have a total overall um, floral top, you know, floral shirt. We make a lot of overall florals, and this kind of gives you that. Um, fun transitional pattern. Now, the fit on this one is a new body style for us. It is our Grace and Lace t-shirt body, okay? If you have the Grace and Lace t-shirt, the GNL t-shirt, you lucked out because you know what size to get in this one. What um, we also did is we kind of took a hybrid hybrid from the Brave Tiger tee, okay? Whoever has the, I'm, I'm trying to help you out for tees, for Grace and Lace tees that you might have in your closet. If you have the Brave Tiger tee, it's also similar in fit to that one, but we, we're doing this new neckline, you guys, which I really, really love, and we're doing more of it um, because I, I really, really love it. It's not a big scoop neckline. I think we call it classic or like classic or something, a classic, between a classic and a scoop. Um, let me put my necklace in so you can see. So it's not too wide. It's not a wide scoop. It's not a deep scoop, but it's lower than a crew. Maybe that's what we call it, between a crew and a classic, something like that, okay? It's lower than a crew neck. So crew necks are usually up here, but doesn't give you like a super deep. So it's a good hybrid to those, for those of you who maybe don't love crews, but also don't like, or maybe like V-necks more than crew necks. It's a good in between. I prefer, this is actually, I, I go towards loving V-necks the most. And then this is my second favorite neckline from that. Okay. Um, it's more true to size than any of our crew necks, except for it's similar to our tiger fit. Okay. It's most similar to our Grace and Lace logo tee. If you have that one, you know what size to buy. It runs more true to size, less oversized than any of our other tee bodies. So I'm in the size small. You can see usually a small in our, um, like our perfect V-neck tee or definitely a perfect pocket tee, which is very oversized. I have a lot of room in the hip. 
I don't have that with this one, okay? So, and same in the bust, nice and fitted at the bust. So I can go to a medium for a more oversized fit. I could not go down to an extra small in this one, okay? So this is my normal size small. So I still have the ability to tuck. I still can knot it. I have a lot tinier of a knot just because of my, um, my hip. I still can knot it though, but um, it is more, it's more true to size. So if I wanted more oversized, I would go up, I'm between, a, like normally a between a small and medium, I would go up to a medium, but I really, really like this fit, which is, this is the same fit too that I prefer in the tiger fit. Okay, Whew. Okay, so many questions. <laughs> Sherry, I have the small on. Um, we can call it, a, oh, Karen, great idea. She said we can call it a necklace crew because it's open enough to show a necklace. Yes, it's lower. Oh, guys, look, I keep, every time I touch my neck, I'm just gonna do this. Um, lower than a crew, not a V, and not like a giant scoop, or even a low and narrow scoop, okay? It's really, it's really good. It's the perfect neckline. Okay, so small on me. If you're between, um, it does run more true to size. I hope by saying tiger fit that that helps you guys because I think you know what size you like in your tiger tee. I like the small in the tiger tee. I can go to a medium in the tiger tee for a looser fit. Um, you do get a little bit more stretch than the tiger tee because the tiger tee had that big graphic um, <clears throat> that is like won't, that will kind of inhibit the stretch in the front. Obviously, this one doesn't have it. Okay. Oh, so many questions. I'm wearing the flip curly. Um, I, I just love um, just to give a little bit more of, um, I don't know. You guys know, I said I'm a, je I'm a jean and tee girl to the core, but I like to elevate the look a little bit. I love our flip cardies for that reason um, because I'm still just in a jean and I'm just, just in the jean and tee. Did I put this on backwards? Oh, no, I didn't. Um, but I put the flip cardie on just to add a little something, something. Okay. Oh, Shelly. Yes, this is the new, which one do I have on? Hope. I um, remember you guys voted on what custom ones I, what uh, new custom words I should make. So we did hope, grace, and faith, which works good for me because I have a Sienna Faith, whose middle name is Faith, and I have Olivia Hope. So both of them want me to switch <laughs> switch out um, with their names and their necklace. But these are coming so soon. We are, these are just our photo samples that I've been wearing like crazy. But those three custom words, grace, faith, and hope are coming super soon super soon okay someone asked about the color on this it's a very it's our ivory ground so it's not creamy it's not bright white let's see okay there's bright paper white nice just sen just very gentle soft white okay should I bring people out in this one all right who is Sophia's in this one yes. Sophia's in this one Oh yeah, I keep forgetting, I wanna call Shelly out first. Okay, small on her, I'm wearing the small too, so you can kind of see she's got a little bit more, yeah. She's gonna have a little, she's more, Sophia's more narrow through the chest, like the shoulder chest area than I am. So she could, she might be able to go up, but she fits the shoulders well. Our shoulders are, are similar, so she fits the shoulder, shoulders well in that. And then, like I said, pair it with a Cardi, pair it with something, you're gonna pull out the florals. Like even if you do denim in here, um, it's just giving you that like pop of an outfit um, in a floral combo pattern, which is really fun. Okay, small on her. I wear large in the Grace and Lace logo tee. Yes, I, I would go with your size and logo tee. We did, we pretty much did. I'm right, right? Yes, it's exact. It's exact. <laughs> they're, they're confirming with me. It's exact as a GNL logo tee. If you don't have a GNL tee, get one. Darn it, I knew you were gonna do this. I wanted to do this outfit. I'm glad someone else is. Ash is doing, see she's pulling out the green. These are $8 jeans. I don't know if they're still $8, but they've My been eight bucks on the site for forever. But see how she's just pulling? She used that the olivey green to pull out her greens here. And then what, your medium, right? I like the medium. Yeah. It's a perfect fit for me. Yeah, because it's more true to size. So if you're busty, she's gonna go medium. I'm, I'm not very busty. I could go up to medium for a little bit more. Aww. Oversized fit, so. Get the jeans, Christine. Love Ashley's outfit, <laughs> it was so cute, okay? So she's just pulling, she's pulling together a color in the bottom to kind of pull out, you know, this fun mix of stuff up here, okay? If you don't have the $9 jeans, I don't know if they're still $9, but they're probably like under 20 if they're still available. Um, that's still, you could even cut them off. If you're not a fan of the blown knee, cut them off. Okay. All right. Next is Natalie is in her normal size large in this one. She's going to drop a little necklace 
down here, dress it up a little bit. Are we wearing the same? No, we have the same jeans on, same outfit. She just doesn't have the flip cardi on, okay? She's in her normal size, so you can see. Nice fit, well through her bust, not too much swing in the hip. Um, looks good, fits her perfectly, okay? Danielle says, Ashley was wearing that outfit I was thinking of wearing, good, I know I like it. Okay, perfect, I'm glad that gives you guys ideas. You guys can always screen shot this to give you outfit ideas, which really, I keep a, I keep a, you can keep like a folder in your, your phone of outfits, outfit ideas. Okay, and then Amanda's in her normal size, right? Yes, oh, and she's wearing other shorts, okay? Um, I showed this one in my picture. I love, again, pulling out that green. Ashley pulled out the green in jeans. Amanda's gonna do it in the twill shorts. Um, you just kind of pull out that color and you have yourself an outfit, okay? Christy says, I love Natalie. She's always smiling. Thanks, guys. Mary, you can buy all of this at graceandlace.com. You can also click, um, there should be a link um, in the text of this video where you can go directly there. Everything is on the new category of our website. So just go to graceandlace.com, click on new, and um, all these things are available currently, okay? Until we sell out. Uh, next up, Perfect Crew Neck Tea Berry Blossom. This is another one you saw. Along with, along with this one, we've only been waiting months for it. Um, this is a combo, what, who is, this is a combo design. I think all of the, all three of the designers had their hand in this one. Um, we work to try to provide you florals that you already don't have. A lot of you shop with us constantly. A lot of you are loving, love our perfect fit tees, perfect pocket tees. Um, and so a lot of you already have a lot of florals already. We're trying to give you a different mix and floral combination that just gives you something you don't already have in your closet. So this is our berry um, floral. You guys, Shelly is on vacation. She is um, with her hubby. She's on a little weekend trip with her hubby, so I'm sorry, but she wears the smallest, Shelly wears the smallest size in this, okay? Um, this is a kind of just the blues. Those of you who like the blue tones, berry tones, this is a really, really good one for you, okay? Because you have, we have all different shades of blues and purples through here. And then with a little touch of olive. So again, this is another one where you're seeing these olive shorts come in that is going to pull out, see that? See how it pull, pulls out all the olive in the stems? Okay, so all the stems have a little bit of olive. You have, I mean, it's just I feel like what this looks like to me is like blackberries and blueberries and raspberries all just made their appearance on this shirt, okay? Because you got the raspberry colors in here. You have them blended with the blueberries. I mean, just, just really pretty blues um, and purples in here make for a good design. Now, this is our standard. This is on, on the listing. It's going to fit like everything else on the listing, okay? This is our crew neck, our perfect crew neck tee. So the neck is not the same as this one. Okay, this is our crew neck, and the body is not the same as this one. The one that I have on has a more narrow fit. This one has our just classic crew neck tee fit, okay? So if you have a crew neck tee from us, get that same fit that you like in this one, but they are, um, these two are different fits. I don't know if you can tell, but this one um, is gonna be roomier than what this one is, okay? Colors are pretty. I know you guys keep on, I keep forgetting to talk about Amanda's haircut. We talk about it every, I, she cut it herself and it looks fabulous, doesn't it? She did it herself. Like she just went with the scissors and started cutting, okay? Ashley, what size are you in the blown knee jeans? I wear an eight. I cannot wear a six in the blown knee jeans. I could probably even wear a 10. Um, those run, those have the least amount of stretch than any denim that we make. They still are stretchy denim, but they're the least amount of stretch and they're just a, a tighter fit. So I wear an eight. Ash? Sheena eight in those? She's an eight. She is an eight in the blow knee, too. Okay. Let's bring some people out in this one. Um, Holly is in this in a extra small, right? Am I right? Give Holly like 30 seconds. Give Holly, give Holly 30 seconds. <laughs> She's coming. Um, I hear her. I hear her feet coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but her outfit's cute. It's it's worth the wait. It's worth the wait. Ah, oh, this is adorable. Holy cow, and look how tall she is. Because she's wearing these freaking tall. I wear those. I, they're so tall. I literally feel like I'm walking on stilts in those. Um, okay, I told you, you guys, look at this. Is this not so cute? So the twill shorts, she's pulling out a little bit of the olive in the berry color olive mix here. 
dropped a little berry necklace to pull out a little bit more berry and then threw on denim jacket. She could cut that up. Cute hat, which is also coming soon. Dang it. Um, but if you, this is a great outfit to look like and feel like your jean and tees girl, but then you have like a cute put together, totally put together outfit. Okay. Extra small on the top. Small in the shorts, which we'll talk about those in a second. Oh my gosh, look at adorable people in the comments. So there's an outfit for you. Easy to put together in your closet. Still in that denim and jeans, jean and tee girl, but you're elevated your look. Okay? That's fabulous. Oh my gosh, now they're all asking about the shorts. Hold on. Let's talk about the shorts. We'll talk about the shorts in a second. Who is next? Sherry? What are our special guests? Yeah. You guys, this is Sherry. I didn't get to hug you yet. Yeah. <laughs> Sherry what? is, so Stacy, Sherry, Stacy's mom. Stacy, well, they're both VIP peers. Okay. <laughs> they're both here. Right. You're going to see Stacy in a second. Stacy and I worked together. Oh my gosh, Stacy. So 20 I years ago. I don't want to say how many years ago. <laughs> but her and her mom are in town for the VIP meet and greet for the, the sample sale tomorrow. You, did you bring Carl? No. Know. Carl didn't come. <laughs> I love Carl. Stacy's husband. We, 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 we all love Carl. We miss him. <laughs> okay. Anyway, mom's here. And so she's also a Grace and Lace fan. So she's got medium shirt, white denim, and then a blue cardi. Okay. See how she just elevated that look from jeans and tee. She's still jeans and tee, but we threw on the cardi and then she has a fun dressier put together look. She could even drop a necklace down on that. Done. Okay. Oh, they're all saying hi. <laughs> That's who our special guests are today. I love, I love, love, love how this has come around. Stacy, oh my gosh, Stacy and I have a million mem memories together many, many years ago. So this is just really fun that I get to see them. Okay. Okay. Um, who else? Michelle's in this, right? Oh, she said, I love her posts. Her and Carl are my faves. I know. I wish Carl, we, Carl's the best. Carl like helps everyone pick out things at the sample sale. Like he's, he, yeah, okay. Um, extra, extra large, right? Those. What are we at? Yeah. What am I at? <laughs> <laughs> Her normal size in this, okay. And she just went to stress jeans. So play it down, dress it up, throw a cardi with it, dress it up, do a heel to dress it up, or go simple jean and tees, girl, okay? Very, very easy. Oh, look at, you guys are all, you guys are all excited. I'm so excited, Stacy contacted me and she's like, hey, we're coming into town. And I'm like, she was like, do you need any guests on your live? And I'm like, absolutely, bring it in. So, um, but yeah, I know, but, but they're all like, where's Carl too? And they all love Carl too. Okay, let's move on. Um, next is the Rio Kimono. Oh, another one, you guys. Um, I mentioned last week that um, we know you have kimonos in your closet, at least if you're a fan of Grace and Lace and have been a fan of ours for a while, you've got kimonos in your closet. I'm trying to give you kimonos that give you different reasons to have more than one, okay? I love to throw a layer. I mentioned this before. I like to throw a layer over my tees. I feel like things like an easy cardi, a flip cardi like this, gives you an elevated look just like a kimono would give you an elevated look. So you can still be jean and tee. You could also not be jean and tee. You can dress these up and go with a cami underneath and a, and a necklace, a tiered mesh. Um, but this is my favorite way because I want to be comfortable in what I'm in, but I want to stay true to who I am. I love, love, love to throw a kimono on. So I was looking for a kimono. I don't have dark kimonos, okay? All my kimonos have light grounds. Um, this one, you guys, is freaking home run. Talk about feeling, we call it the Rio kimono, and I feel like you just walk out of like tropical island world in this thing, okay? This is Amanda's baby. Um, it is a placement print. So let's kind of show you what is going on here. All right, I'm gonna pull out the sleeves. You can get the feel, okay? So this whole thing is a border, is a placement print. So you've got this fun border running all the way down and around. Now that's gonna collapse down because this is your sleeve, okay? So the sleeves on both sides collapse down like you're wearing it, this is the back, like you're wearing it like this. I'm showing you the back because that's where the pattern really, really shows off. And then this just kind of frames your shape. Okay, so you have, I don't even know where to start in this thing. We have teals and pops of pink and pops of reds and oranges, bright mustardy yellows. Um, oh, this is like a pretty orchid, this color through here, like a pretty orchid color. And then this is all like the aqua teal. And then lots of, we don't, we don't do an orange a lot. And I feel like that was just a play on the color that works really, really well. So that carries 
this is your back this is that major major statement print right here and then it carries down into this fun border okay um then you have now we did these fun little kind of coordinating tassels all the way around the bottom i felt this really just brought in the fun element i'm gonna throw this on don't wear this outfit definitely don't layer, don't layer your flip cardi and your kimono over each other okay so don't copy what i have on but oh man i might even be getting caught up with two um cardies on at the same time okay um but those, uh, the tassels just bring an extra swing of feeling like you are on a vacation. So whether you are on a vacation and you're wearing this to the beach or whether you want to feel like you're on a vacation, um, this one just really shows off that style, okay? I wore this one, um, we went to Florida to visit my mom um, for spring break and um, this was just really easy to throw on. The swimsuit with just a tee underneath. Um, man, I threw it on to protect my shoulders from the sun. And then, like I said, the tassels just add that fun little element. Now, if you're not a tassel girl, okay, you can trim. We made the tassels easy um, to be clipped off. I like it. I feel like it provides a little bit of hang. Like it really kind of pulls the material on. But if you're really like, no, I gotta get rid of the tassels, or if you have a cat that's gonna drive you crazy <laughs> with these tassels, um, you can. There's just a lead um, right here, so you can just take an, a scissors and just snip that right out. So. Don't tell me, don't tell me you did it. Make me sad. But if you really, really did not want the tassels, I just think they complement it. I think it's really, really fun, fun to wear. Um, there is an armhole. Okay, so this is not like a ruana. It doesn't just, it's not, it, it is gonna stay on because you do have the um the drape. Okay. Um now this does come due to the printing a number number of colors. I would recommend that you wash this when you get it. There is a finish on it when it first comes out of the package um that finish that holds these um colors that finish will come off when you wash it and it will cause it to fall and drape a little bit more so if you feel like when you take it out of the package that it has a slight finish on it go ahead and just send it follow the care instructions send it through your machine in a garment bag remember you don't want these tassels to get caught up in everything else in your wash um in a garment bag and that that will cause the the, the material um hangs and drapes won't have that finish on it okay okay Let's bring out people. Who's in this? Sophia's in this one. Right? Sophia. Yes. <laughs> okay. Um, in normal Grace and Lace fashion, we are giving you either what you have in your closet or what you can buy currently on our website that is going to pull out and bring out all the fun colors. So you can go totally neutral. Stick a Heather Gray under this. You can stick just a white tee on it or a white cami or whatever and let it speak for itself or do something like this and pull out a color that is already in here, okay? If you have our um, burnout tee in the, I felt kind of this color, but it was a burnout tee, that's what I wore with it. You'll, you will find Grace and Lace is already in your closet that looks good with it. Okay, turn around for us so we can see. So see that just, it's just, just gonna drape, hang, blow, you just throw it on. Easy, easy to build a statement outfit um, with just one piece, okay? All right. Love the drape better in the arms. Okay. Oh, I think she's talking to someone else. Okay, next is, um, oh, Stacy's in this one. Hi. Yay! <laughs> I heard her voice up here and I was getting ready. I didn't get to say hi. So, yes, Stacy and I worked together, I don't know, what was it, 20 years ago? Yeah, I don't know. 2001. Yes. Two, I, the, I, we're not that old. <laughs> I'm sure, maybe. We'll just say we're not that old. I like that answer better than so many years ago. But we have so many memories working together, and she's yes. just she's been a fan of Grace and Lace, and I yes. just love her support, and so we welcome her to our, to our bit try on stage and to our sample sale. Her and Carl were the king and queen of sample sale like love two it. years ago. Two I know, years we miss ago. Carl. <laughs> You're gonna meet how your mom is gonna have to mom, step it up. Yes, exactly. Step Carl up. insisted on it. He was trip. like pulling stuff, he knew exactly what to grab, he was helping everyone out, showing like, ooh, you look in this. I'm like, man, I need to hire Carl. So yes. okay. Anyway, Stacy's Stacy's put it with a dress, okay? Again, jean and tees. Cardi, I mean, hammy and jeans. Whatever you want to do, dress, dress, dress up. Try to give us a little yes. spin so you can see, yeah. okay? It's just going to flow, lay right along with the dress. This is our, our the dress and hibiscus, yes. okay? Just turn it over that. Little drop necklace, sandal, done. Easy. Okay? Okay, easy outfit. Oh, they're so excited to see you. This is one of your VIPs, guys. <laughs> okay. Um, and then this is two sizes, and you're in the smaller of the two. Yes. Right? Okay. Yes. That extra small through medium in these two. Okay. Awesome. Yay. 
Thanks, guys. Um, oh, they love it. Okay, so weather with a dress, weather with a tee, dress it up with a cami, go tiered mesh on it, and you have a dressed up look. Go a, go with a burnout, one of your burnout tees. You guys have tees in your closet, I promise you. You don't need to buy something to make an outfit. You can buy something to make an additional outfit, but I guarantee you, you have colors in your closet of Grace and Lace shirts that work very well with this. Okay. Ah, they love seeing VIPs rock. She was our, her mom, her and her mom are our guests today. All right. And then next we have uh, Michelle. I hope I'm looking at the right thing. Okay. okay. And she's going to pull out the yellow. Okay. Just pick your choice. Pick what you want. Pull out oranges, pull out the berries, pull out the reds, pull out the blue, I mean, whatever, where she's going with a yellow tank underneath, okay? And she's in the larger of the two sizes, the large, extra large, which is normal for her fit and size, okay? Thought I read. Um, do we have the sizing right? Maybe it is. Can someone check online? Am I saying that there's two sizes, but there's one size? There's one size. There's one size. Oops. Sorry, guys. This is one size. Oh. <laughs> I... I uh, told you wrong. So one size fits most. There are not two sizes in this one. There is one size in this one. The way that it's shaped, the way the arms are, like you're either going to, um, if you're taller or bigger, you'll pick it up a little bit more. If you're more narrow, it'll drop down a little bit farther. So, okay. So there's one size in this one. Sorry. Thanks for correcting me, you guys. One size because there's not much of a fit. You guys will see a kimono like this. Well, you can see where the sleeves are, are tacked but it's really just a giant like scarf with armholes, okay? So that'll stay up. You're not like a Ruana pulling this over your shoulders, um, but you'll just have more draper hang. See, it just kind of doesn't, these don't really have a fit. Okay, sorry guys. Thanks for, thanks for telling me it is one size and they're all wearing the same size. <laughs> Hopefully that helps. Okay, let's move on. Dobby Dot dress is next. I'm trying to go fast, you guys. Okay, um, we don't do a whole lot of more of, I don't want to use the word formal. I don't think formal is right, but dressier, dressier dresses. Can we do that? Dressier dresses. But with Mother's Day here, with um, graduations, with weddings, with um, finally things like coming back to life where we're going out, um, we thought we needed to bring in more of a dressy option. Okay, like I said, graduations, Mother Day, Mother's Day, going out for lunch, brunch, whatever, like Sunday, Sunday dress up. Um, so this is kind of a dressier dress than what we normally our dresses are real casual. I would call this one like a dressier, dressier option for us. This is our Dobby Dot dress in hibiscus pink. I think is what we call it. Does that sound right? And it's a showstopper. Um, the texture and the fit, I feel, is what makes it a so showstopper. So these are all little textured Dobby dots, okay, running all through the material. They're nice and fuzzy. This is like a chiffon material, nice little um, flutter shoulder that comes over. Um, it's fully and completely lined. So this is a soft um, lining on the inside. So the whole thing, let me show you. There's the lining, okay, fully lined all the way down um, to give you kind of that dressier fit and the dressier fit here in the zipper. So there's a zipper fit opening, um, which you'll just unzip it, put it on to pull it over your head and then zip it back up. Okay. And then just a really nice, um, you know, nice little dress fit. Okay. Um, so this gives you all the special occasions that you're thinking about. This is a really, really pretty dress for that. Again, the color and the texture is what just really, really screams like, um, I don't know, it just, it just, it kind of just speaks as really, really pretty, giving off that, that texture. Now for fit on this, this is a more fitted style, but I would stay in your normal size if you're between sizes and broad and busty, okay? Um, I would consider sizing up. The only other reason I would size up is if you're really tall and you want more length, okay? So only color in this guy, you guys. We we just haven't done much of this category before, so this is kind of tipping our toes into it. So just the bright hibiscus prank, great for spring and summer. Um, just really, really screams like summer. Really pretty, okay? Um, so stay in your normal size. I can wear the small. I wear the small, okay? I wear the small. The small is, um, you know, fitted here through the chest, and then you're not going to get, you don't have to worry much about your fit of your hips because it is a flowy 
waistline, okay? So from here down, it's kind of flowy. The only fit is really gonna be up here through the chest. The medium, um, I can wear the medium as well. So I'm between sizes and that's why I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you that I can go either way. Um, where did we land? Do I prefer, Holly, do we land? Did I prefer the medium or I prefer the small? small. Okay. Um, I don't really, I put, I put both of them on like six times <laughs> earlier this week because I kept going back and forth. I, I would buy either. I don't, I mean, the small is more fitted on me through the bus because I'm broad. Okay. Um, and the medium obviously gave me more room there. So, and I'm between sizes. I'm only telling you that because I'm just between sizes. Otherwise I would stay in your normal size. If you know you're narrow and not busty in between sizes, then size down. Okay. So go with your top, your woven tops size. Um, not a stretchy top size, okay? This is not, these are both woven, this is woven material, okay? Um, go with your woven top size. Don't worry about your waistline or your hip or anything in here because that's where you've got the flowiness, okay? All right, um, who's in this one? Holly is in this one in a extra small, okay? So, and she's five, seven, way taller than me. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so she's showing you, we can do a little dress extender. I knew some of you would like this. You could do the dress extender under this, give yourself a little bit more length, or if you wanted a little more pop of something. Okay, so she, extra small, she's between, she's between an extra small and a small on top, but you're definitely more narrow size. So mm -hmm. she's going down um, for the more narrow fit, okay, through the, through the bust, okay? Really pretty on her. That's extra small on her. How does, oh, shoot. Carla, I knew someone would ask. How does this compare to the dang green dress? <laughs> Victoria? <laughs> I named it. You, she didn't call it. Car, she did, Carla did not call it the dang green dress. I called it the dang green dress. Similar fit. Okay, similar. Victoria's saying similar. Yeah, it's hard to compare because of the sleeve. Hard to compare because of the sleeve. The, the dang green dress had long sleeve. This is kind of giving you shoulder sleeve. Okay. But bust is similar, okay? Keep that in mind. All right, next is Ashley. It's fabulous, Ashley. <laughs> Ashley's in a medium, okay? And that's, um, this gives her a really nice fit through the bust, nice through the back, nice flow through the waist, okay? You can see, just nude heel is great with this. Let the dress do the speaking, okay? Could do really simple. She could do a little simple necklace up here or I something. Could. Yeah, simple jewelry. She, she chose the, the um, bracelets. And then a nude shoe, okay? Really easy, really flattering. Doesn't she look like she's going somewhere, like a graduation event? I don't know. Wedding? I am going somewhere tonight. Wedding? Well, you are. Are you wearing this? No. No, she's not wearing this. No. With I knew shoes, that. My, I can't feel my three toes on my left. <laughs> she's not wearing that to the VIP <laughs> meet and greet tonight. No. Okay. Beautiful. Very beautiful. Nice and fit. Great coverage. If you guys, sometimes there's lots of times there's dresses up there that don't give you your regular bra coverage. Drives me nuts. I've been trying to find a dress for a wedding that... I'm in this summer and I'm like, man, I just want to be, I want, I want to design my own dress because I want something that I can just wear my normal bra, okay? Full back coverage for that normal bra, not too deep of a V, normal bra, okay? Makes it very easy, okay? I don't like all the complicated stuff. Uh, next, um, Natalie, right? I just should turn around and look. I don't know why. <laughs> okay, see how pretty, see how this just collapses and falls. Very, very pretty with bust. So she's on the bustier side, but see how this just just collapses down, creates a little pleat, gives her a nice shape. I'm going to show off your back because it's really, really flattering on the back, and I should have showed on Ashley too. See how this just comes down, shapes her back really nicely, and then comes down over her hips. It's just going to fall and do that. Like, look really, really pretty hanging on the body, and your shaping is up here um, through the back, okay? Really pretty on her. That's her normal size large, Okay. What size is, is Amanda coming out in this one? Amanda is. Amanda is. You're going to find out one second. Amanda's in it. Okay. She looks like a princess, too. <laughs> what does Amanda look like? Here you go. Do, do, do. Really pretty. Okay. Again, fit it through the bust. Nice shaping through the back. Okay. You get that. And then it's just going to fall. See this? Again, nice shaping through here. And then just falls down from the low back over the hips. Really, really pretty fit. Okay. Amanda's in her normal size extra large. Yes. And beautiful Natalie. Okay. Does that give you kind of a feel for this dress? It is a dressier dress. I would not call this like an everyday, maybe some people dress like this every day, um, but it absolutely could be a work dress or something like that, but I would call it like an occasion, like a special, a special occasion. Not like formal wear or anything like that, but just a really, really pretty springtime summer dress. Dang, Amanda, that looks gorgeous. I agree, I love Amanda's hair. Yep, y'all do. Okay, moving along, holy cow. Let's keep, let's keep going. 
Oh, summer weight live, finally. Summer weight live in loggers. Let's talk about summer weights. Now, we have two weights in our loggers. I should ask you guys this. You guys know the answers to all this, okay? We have a regular weight and a summer weight. Now, there is kind of an in-between weight, which is our camo, just because of the way the camo affected the print. Don't think about that one right now, okay? We're gonna think about your regular, regular weight loggers. These are not it. These are very, very different than your regu regular weight loggers, okay? The regular live-in loungers, I should go by the real, real name. Regular live-in loungers have compression. They feel like a legging with jogger details, okay? The jogger pockets, the jogger kind of waistline, tie band, ankle, okay? They feel like a compression or legging. Now, our regular ones do. Summer weights feel like you have nothing on your body, okay? That is the major difference. They are very light, they are very stretchy, but it literally feels like, I put these on the other day and I was like, because I haven't busted out my, my summer loggers yet, it literally feels like you're feel, you feel nothing on your body. They are the most comfortable things on earth. Now, most people wear these for lounging at home, sleeping in pajamas they're nice and soft and brushed okay they have a soft they they almost have like a silky component and i'm going to go on when i talk about this because the blue tie-dye even has a silkier component to it which we'll talk about in a second so do not compare these to any of your regular weight loggers they're going to feel for those of you who have don't have a summer weight these are going to feel very different on your body I would still recommend, now some people say they like to size down in summer weights. I, you can do that, but we really made them to literally feel like nothing on your body. If you size down, my concern is that you're stretching the material a little too far and you're gonna get too sheer, especially if you're curvy. So you, I, I we made these to stay in your normal size. If you need to, uh, you can use the functional drawstring here if you need to hold them up. We really wanted them to feel like that lounge, pajama, feel like nothing you're on your body, okay? My concern is if you size down, I think the material is not made like we, we if we would have made it, we could have made this compression, um, but we didn't, we wanted you to have that feel of just really comfortable running down your body like you feel like you have nothing on your body, okay? Um, Sarah, the black summer weight launched today. It is here, so the four colors, black summer weight, berry summer weight floral it's fun this is amanda floral no yeah no shelly shelly and amanda might have tag team this one together um shelly and amanda floral on this one and then a really fun it is not this bright sorry guys my lights are really brightening this up this is not bright royal blue it's actually a very dusty there we go sarah's gonna cut my light light a little bit so you can see but this is a really good way to see the tie-dye variants in here okay it's a tonal navy on navy it still looks a lot brighter right here than what it looks like in real life it's very dulled dulled down navy blue um so those four colors summer weight loggers these are the only summer weight loggers coming this year okay summer weights are the best Yes, they are. So these are not, these are ours that are made overseas. They are not our Capri version. We did a chase run due to COVID made in the USA last year of a, um, a crop, like a Capri lager. These are not it. These are the same as the, um, remember the Navy floral? Oh, that one was so popular. Navy floral last year. Um, okay, someone's asking about the colors. I'm gonna talk about the colors in a second. Very, very stretchy extremely stretchy i would not size down to the stretchy this though we do not want these to become sheer but you don't want to max max your stretch out in these you really want to stay in your normal size so the berry i feel like if someone asked about the berry color i feel like this is showing it's a very um purpley nice purpley berry it seems a little bright in the camera maybe because of the light um it's a little deeper darker than this okay hold on Clarification, Jessica, I'm catching you. Careful, okay, clarification, please. Do these summer loggers fit differently than the original summer loggers? They are the same as the original 
summer loggers, like the very first year we did them. They are not the same. We came last year, we did summer loggers, and then we came out with a Capri summer logger. The Capri summer logger was made in the U.S., and that was different. The material um, and working with a U.S. factory, they just weren't able to nail it as well as what we do with a stretch on this one. So they are the same as like, wasn't there like a, a dusty, charcoal-y, navy, um, like a soft blue? I don't know. I'm making I'm pulling this out, you guys. Because Jessica, am I helping you? It's the same as the navy floral last year. If I had a little picture I could put up on the screen to show you. There was a dark navy multicolor floral. And did we do solids last year, Amanda? What? Sorry. Did we do so, so, solids in these with the same as the we navy did, floral? Yeah, we did seaport and we seaport. did the mid heather gray or okay. some kind of heather gray. Okay, heather gray might feel a little bit different with heathered materials. These are most like the um, navy floral. I <laughs> hope that's what it's called. Okay, they do have a little bit. So compared to regular loggers, these are slightly ankle version. These are a little bit of a cropped ankle version. We wanted to give you a summer feel, summer weight, summer length. So they are not the crop. They are not the, the Capri ones last year that were like here. These are just fall right at the ankle. The regular loggers are a little bit, you can check the inseams. The regular loggers are a little bit longer than what these are. Okay. Oh man, you guys are, you guys are asking about color, about comparison with other colors. Seaport. Yes, they would fit the same as the seaport. Yes, whoever asked that. Joy. Okay. Um, no, the sea foam, the, the redwood was not a summer weight. That was a regular weight logger. That's not a summer weight logger. Okay. I'm the navy ones all the time. No, wait. All right. The last thing I want to mention and bring girls out is the. Oh, it is not this bright. Don't look. <laughs> Don't look. It is not this bright. It's really, really dulled down. Very, very dulled down navy. This one, particularly with the navy, with how it came out with a tie dye, even has a slinkier. Okay. It almost feels silky on the inside. Like, no, it does feel silky. Okay. So if you are a logger expert, I know there are logger, but I should explain, stop. Oh my gosh, people are like, why are you talking about loggers? Loggers, the name is really live in loungers. We call logger because it's a, between a legging and a jogger, okay? That's where you get logger for those of you tuning in the first time. This one even has slightly just, it's, it has a slight, it, you put your legs in here and you don't ever want your legs to come out. Let's just stop right there and then say it, okay? It literally feels like it's cool. It has like this cool hand, like I almost get goosebumps putting it on my hand because of how cool um, it feels. So if you're a logger expert, um, you will notice, that's why I know I'm talking to you guys out there. You will notice that this one might have slightly just, it has a little bit more of the cooling fibers in there that feel a little bit more slinkier. They're all slinky. Oh my gosh, they all have that silky, slinky feel on the inside. Um, but that one even feels a little bit even more slinkier than these ones do, okay? Okay, <sighs> let's bring out some people. Let's stop talking. Holly is in the small, what did I do for her, Shelly? Yeah, okay, pajama time. Okay, this is what I want to be wearing right now, and I'll probably just put that on with this, and so is the show's done, because it's rainy and overcast, okay? so. Lounging, pajamas, she's in She's in her small, okay? She's not going down an extra small. She's staying in her small in these. Just for lounging, easy to wear. Throw on a t-shirt, a cardi, your robe. You won't want to get out of them, I promise, okay? Slippers, easy, okay? Small on her. Holly's wearing a small. She can do extra small sometimes in some things, on her, but her bottom is closer. She's kind of like me. Like, I'm top size of small going into medium. In between sizes, she is really closer to extra small, she's extra small on top, um, but she's like a two four. So she's um, small on bottom. Sometimes she can do extra small. She prefers the small in these, okay? Okay, Holly is five seven, Holly? Yeah. Five seven, Holly's five seven. She had those really tall wedges on that made her look like she was five ten. Okay, uh, next is Ashley in these. Medium, here's the black. Chance to snag the black. I hope these are not sold out. You guys, black, flies out of here like crazy. So standard black, nice, like, just, I, know, I just feel like doing standard. I actually prefer the small. Oh, they're, they're, these are the mediums. Here, let me take this. Okay. 
shut up. This is a medium. This is, I'm going to say the same thing that I said last this week about a couple stretchy. of different things. Most of you will be able to wear two sizes in this, just like I've said with some of our stretchier jeans. And that is because it just has so much stretch. Yeah. So if you want to use the stretch, eh, size down. Just be careful with that if you're curvier. Um, otherwise, stay in your normal size in these. I like my size small. I could go up to medium for a looser fit. Literally, the, the medium feels like I'm wearing Yeah. Pink. No, yeah. no pink. You don't I mean, I'm not going to complain about your size. <laughs> I will not, wear it either she's size. She's not wearing any. It just feels like you're not wearing anything. It feels like the greatest thing ever, okay? It's like the pant, non-pant pant. This okay? is what I'm wearing tonight. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. You can wear that tonight. Jumpsuit. Ah, Brandy, I know it's sold so fast. Uh, check the VIP page. I posted on there yesterday right before I left work. I We are working with a design and production team to remake that, okay? The factory is going to kill us. Um because we want it early transitional fall and I did a vote for color get over there on the VIP page and vote for color um to help us out because we like literally are rushing rushing that through to um re remake that for early fall okay next uh Natalie's no yes Natalie's in these her, in her normal size large our floral plan I didn't really bring up I'll bring the floral plan closer floral floral pattern closer so you can see but um, pops of yellow, orange, pinks in here with a dark, dark um, ground, gray grounds, blacks in there. She just threw it on with a weekend tee. Okay, that is a weekend look. Running errands, dropping kids off somewhere, get out of bed, don't even change. Like, it just is easy. Okay, yes, yeah, she's wearing her normal size large. Okay, oh, Catherine's giving me her vote. She says Olive, her next jumpsuit. I think we're leaning towards Olive. We had Maddie tell, had to tell all the votes, and she said Olive was winning. Okay, and then Amanda, right? Okay, she's got the navy. Oh, I think it, that worked better to see the color with standing not as close to the light, okay? Dark, nice dark tonal. It just gives that little bit of texture. I love the way that we did this tie-dye. You just get a little bit of texture variance. It's not like a crazy spiral tie-dye, okay? She's in her normal size, extra large. Any other questions on that one? Okay. Um, Amanda's wearing extra large. Yes. Love this on Natalie. Any other questions about loggers? Get them now. Last chance for, we have no other. Um, this is the four colors we did in summer white. Um, loggers as they are. Uh, we have a, I think we have like a, we have a couple other different bodies coming in this material, but summer for loggers, this is all, all we have. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes, Catherine, that's what I said. Get out of bed. Don't even have to change. Run, to the, run the kids wherever they need to be, and then you're not going to want to get dressed for the rest of the day because you don't want to take it off. Okay. Let's go on. Let's do um, 12 summer shorts. Holy cow, you guys. I am. Woo! 12 summer shorts. We did, um, <clears throat> last year, we did a floral short, okay? And the reason I'm bringing up this discussion is because it's, probably what you're most familiar with us in terms of a non-denim short. We've made denim shorts for forever, not forever, several years, but um, I wanted to give you kind of the most similar, mm, this is the most similar comparison that is not a denim short. This is a twill material, I'm going to show you an olive because you can see it better, okay? This is a twill material, so it's not like um like a woven fashion top a printed fashion top it's thicker it's thicker than that okay it's a twill can you see i don't know if you can see the twill fibers in there it's very drapey and very slinky feels like it has tencel in it okay it's like a the tencel jacket just very very silky very drapey but it's not just like um i don't even have a woven shirt here to compare it to it's not just like a woven shirt material okay it is the twill material nice deep pockets in the front tie adjustable tie waist band here and then it has faux pockets in the back we went back and forth on this to make these real or fake and i'm glad we did faux sometimes with shorts like this you can get a real bunchy pocket bag in the back and i don't like that okay so these are faux they're stitched down but they're there for the details you cannot open those up there's not a pocket bag you're not going to get big old squares bunched up in your butt okay and but these are nice and deep and um great in the front uh true to size this is a lower mid rise okay so these are kind of meant these are not as high our, my our jeans usually come up to my belly button this is probably an inch or so lower they're kind of just meant to be like that casual short you saw holly and i'm i'll see if she's coming back in them again but um it's just that casual short that you pull on but you can dress this up kind of that you can't you can dress this up in ways that you really can't dress denim up 
pay. It gives you, you can do, oh man, oh, here's this outfit, okay? That's what I wore the other day. Um, it gives you that um, elevated look, but super, super comfortable. I would go with the size, okay? If you have the floral shorts from last year, I would go with the size that you like in the floral printed shorts from last year. If you don't have those, I'm gonna say go with your true size. Now, I am between a small and a medium. My hips are big and my thighs are big for a small, okay? Right here. So, I can go to a medium for a looser fit. If I want more casual fit, if I don't want it to hug my butt, I would go with a medium. I can go down to the small, um, and it's a little bit snug on my legs. But again, you guys, my leg circumference and, sorry, circumference and my hips are bigger for a size small. So I'm just letting you know between sizes, you can go either way. Okay, I think Holly, this is a good example too. So she's a between sizer er. She's going to go, she prefers to go up to the small. She can wear the extra small, but they're pretty. They're like fitted because the material doesn't have stretch. You have stretch in the waistband. Oh, Debbie, great question. I'm going to address that in one second. You have um, stretch in the waistband, okay? And you have the ability to tie. Now, I'm going to give you a tip about our waistbands. Holly is our new technical designer, and she is killing the waistband game for us, okay? We have known that we've struggled with waistband tension in the past, and I know that's been a struggle with you to not to know your size, and she is adamant to get this right where we don't have tight waistbands. So, da -da -da, from now on, we are killing it in the waistband game. So these are, these are nice, not too much tension, even in the small. I don't have too much tension, but it stays against my stomach, okay? So it's not, we don't want you to feel like we're trying to get away from the mistakes that we've made in the past with you guys saying, you, we've taken your feedback. You've said, your waistbands aren't comfortable, or I like the small, but I prefer the medium for the waist, looser waistbands. We're trying to um, fix that problem for you, okay? We're trying to get better and improve our waistbands. So she made improvements on the waistbands in this that does not make this snug. Doesn't, it's not loose where it's going to fall up and down or force you to tie it, but it's not snug, okay? Here on out. Holly's in charge of waistbands and she's rocking it. Okay. So not as it just, it's going to stay nice fit, but not super snug. All right. Should I bring people out? Two colors in that, olive and black you saw. Um, Sophia's in this, in a small. We're all talking about waistbands now. <laughs> okay. Dress up or dress down. This is another one. Guys, it can be as simple. This is, I call these shorts, I should just name them Ashley shorts. These are the types of shorts, exactly. Ashley, these are Ashley shorts. Okay, she loves to do a short like this. You can go dressy and go up with a cami. You can dress an outfit up or go as simple as a graphic tee, okay? These are just, this is what Ashley, these are Ashley shorts <laughs> all the time. Ashley, um, sorry, <laughs> Sophia is wearing a size small and you can see on her, just nice fit, nice, not too tight, not too loose, just has nice, sits perfect. nicely, perfect on her. All right, I need to stop talking pretty soon because I don't want to mix up all my words. All right, next is... Ashley. No? This is me. Ashley. This is me. This is Ashley outfit. Every day. Ashley top, Ashley yeah. shorts, Ashley flip flops. Signature flip flops. This is what she wore to work yesterday. So y'all want to hear something funny about these flip flops? Melissa and I love mine? them. No. Oh. These are Sanooks and they feel like you have uh, a like yoga, yoga mat. mat. So we always have the same shoe. If we have these in black and gold. And the only reason we why we know that we're not wearing our shoes is because the imprint is different imprint on of our feet. Wait, wait, I think these are yours. So we'll fling our shoes to each other. Kick these them are off yours. Each other. You have my shoes on my foot. Imprints are different. Okay. This is Ashley outfit to the core. She loves to do a button up. She puts these shorts on. She size medium in the shorts. Okay. She ties it up. That's what she wears to work every day. Yep. Hey, Ashley outfit. I should name them Ashley shorts. Why do you even call them tool shorts? Medium in these. I can do the medium. The medium gives me a little bit more room through my hip. The small is a little bit snug on my thighs, um, but I think it's going to loosen up a little bit. So I'm going to wear those a little bit longer. It's the same story as the same way I felt about the floral shorts last year is I could go up to medium for a looser fit through my thigh. Um, but I think I like, I think I like the small, even though it's tighter on, on me. Um, I think it'll loosen up a little bit. Ash is flared. We literally flip our shoes at each other when we when we don't have the wrong one, right ones on. Okay. And then Natalie in her lodge. Hey, this is what I was saying. Grab a graphic tee, throw on a pair of shorts, pair of flip-flops, and then she just threw on a hat, which makes this totally elevated. You're in a t-shirt, 
and shorts, but doesn't she have cute? Like, she almost has, like, a beachy look. Like, I feel like she, we need to go to, like, brunch or lunch or something. This is cute, okay? Large um, shorts on her, so she's got good relaxed room. They're just going to fall and drape and hang, okay? They just, like, they they don't, they're not made to be cut up. Now, the small on me catch up a little bit on my legs. That's why I'm saying I could go to the medium between sizes, okay? Um, Rita, yes, I'll do that for you. I will try on the small in the medium, okay? So you can see, you'll see, you'll see, I'll try them on the olives so you can tell the difference on me between the small and the medium. I would stay in your normal size, unless between sizes or if you know you carry your weight in your thigh. I carry, this is where, right here, okay? That's where, right here is where I'm not a size, not a size small unless it has stretch. All right, uh, Natalie, oh, they're asking Natalie, how is the waist? Natalie, how's the waist on you? Um, fine. Fine. Okay. Yep. So these do sit lower. Don't try to pull these up to be high waisted. I mean, you can, but you're gonna get some riding, and they're not meant to be a high waisted short. They are mid. They're they are lower than where our jeans sit by by um, an inch or so. Like they're meant to just kind of sit and ride and fall on the hips to be a real comfortable fit. Okay. Next is Amanda. No, it's me. No, Michelle. I stole them. I wanted to wear them. Okay. So. <laughs> okay. Perfect. Extra large here. Yep. Uh, and then T tank, whatever. Feel like summer, but see how that elevated? Like she doesn't just have a pair of denim shorts on. She's got a, a green like outfit that's pulled together with this in the and So if you have her desert dreams, there's an outfit for you. Okay. There's her normal size. I would say stay in your normal size Ouch. unless you know you carry your weight in your hips or thigh or in your um, or here in your thigh, and then consider sizing up. If you're more narrow, like if you're real narrow through the waist and the hips, you could probably go down. I don't know. Yes, Debbie, I know. Looked so cute with the Desert Dreams tank. All right, lastly, the repurposed drop denim. <laughs> I have these on. Oh, you guys, these are supposed to be here in March. I'm just glad they didn't come in August when we were thinking that they would probably come. Okay, our repurpose line, these are um, right here, it tells you. It says, this item keeps plastic bottles out of oceans. Is that upside down for you? <laughs> There's our repurpose line. This um, is our repurposed denim. So we did, um, we've done a couple of things in these. Last fall, we introduced this to you. This literally saves 80, up to 80 water bottles from the ocean, okay? Now, um, it does not feel like plastic. That is where the miracle comes. Fit is similar to um, our other repurposed denim from the fall. However, I feel because of the light wash, this is a little bit stretchier. Okay, some of you, um, I'd still stick in your normal size that you like in our repurposed denim if you have the darker washes, but I do feel it's not quite as snug, and I think that's probably because um, of just the lighter wash. Okay, so nice, easy, non-distressed, front and back. Has a little bit of the shadowing there for dimension, a little bit up here. Nice, clean, non-distressed. It is like a crop, cropped length. I did my little, I did a little roll. So there's where, the, there's where the length is. I like to just, my summer stuff, I like to give it a half roll. I don't know how. Okay. Um, I would still stay in your repurpose size if you know your purpose denim. This is my normal size six. Um, I just feel there may be a smidge not as tight. Okay, all right, does that help? Who's in this one? Last thing, Holly's in this in a four. Throwing my hair all over the place here. <laughs> She's in the crowd running. <laughs> okay, sporty look, sneakers, you can go sandals, flip flops. I mean, just a great way to transition into cooler weather, but if you're maybe not a shorts person, this is a good, it's not a heavy, heavy, thick, heavy denim. Nice and stretchy, lightweight, four on her. T, sneakers, flip flops, easy. Next is Ashley is in 6'2". I'm in 6. I like how, thanks, Sunny. Um, Holly's wearing her normal size 4. I'm wearing my 6. Ashley's wearing 6 or an 8. I'm in 6. I'm in 6. Yep. Okay. Easy, nice, and summery. She is shorter than me, so you can see they hit her a little bit longer. And I also did that. I did a half roll on mine. So she could half roll hers up or even Sorry, double. I was getting dressed. <laughs> double roll hers up or she. Well, you're like winter on top. But that's like perfect for this weather. weather. Winter on top um, and party on the bottom. She's sneaking a tank. Yeah, you want to see, a, she, see a little closer? <laughs> she's sneaking a tank. Dang it. Okay, coming soon. 
Okay, but wait. that's good for this weather. I don't. You, she got a peel got right a before a peel. peel. She got a chemical peel like the day before a VIP event. Like, I may let. I may be older my, than everybody here, but my. I now look younger. Anyways, <laughs> is this wash comparable to Shark Bait? Oh, Christine, I can show that. Can someone throw me a shark bite? Back there. Oh, yeah. That's shark a good bite comparison. Bite. Who's got shark, shark bite? bite? There's probably some in the model closet. Sorry, guys. I know I'm going long. This was a big launch, but this is the last thing. Um. Those of you, my last thing to say while she's looking for digging for a shark bite is our sample sale. I said this in the beginning. It is still going on. Rain, shine, snow. Well, I'm not going to snow here, but rain or shine. Downpouring. The first year we did this, it was absolutely downpouring outside. Oh my gosh, I had nightmares of that first sample sale. It is indoors. We're moving everything indoors. If we, our warehouse guys cleared out one of our receiving docks, our bays, um, and there will be a line. Get here early. Okay, if you're in Texas, get here early. That's all I'm saying. Stuff gets picked over, but it is the most samples we have ever had. Oh, thanks to COVID. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> that works. Okay, here's the color difference. So you have more tonal difference in the shark bites than the different than what's in these. The shark bite is gonna give you there's there's they're darker at the seams and there's hatching in these. These do not have the hatching. Okay. Those are a lighter wash. Hopefully that helps. Joy, uh, when is the pink fair coming? <sighs> we worked so hard to make that pink fair come at the same time that the floral, the Florence kimono, and that one is on a transport issue delay. So every week we just cross our fingers and pray and hope that the fair will be here. And but we're told it's probably going to be a couple more weeks until they get that boat into the docks. <clears throat> Just so frustrating. I'm like, can I just drive my own boat out there and take that container myself? Um, so unfortunately, that's what this whole year's in. Whatever we've planned to merchandise together, things that we have shot together, styled together, that was all supposed to arrive together. Um, it's just not happening this today, this way, these days. Um, the, the supply and demand issue is severe. And it's not just in clothing. We're talking in lumber manufacturing equipment, medical equipment. I know you guys work in several different fields that are having massive delays on your supplies. Um, it's nuts and it's really bad, but we are hoping it, as soon as it gets here, I promise I'll have to do. <laughs> okay, that's it. Today's live. Hope you're coming to the sample sale. We are gonna hope, we're gonna get some behind the scenes. We'll have Lyric take some pictures. Um, I have two on Wait, what? Oh my gosh! Ah, I forgot. I'm like, wait, what? I forgot to bring them out in their jeans. I totally stopped at like Ash, and then we just moved on. Oh my gosh! <laughs> They're like, we did all the work changing to this. Like, get us on the camera as least you can see. Okay, normal size ten. Okay, I'm guessing normal size ten in there. Here's where it hits on her legs. She doesn't have um, it cuffed up like I did. I just put a little single cuff in it. Okay, normal size in there. T hat done. And then Michelle. <laughs> Sorry, girls. I'm like looking at the time going, I've kept you guys on this live for way too long. I just need to get them off. Okay, same thing. Normal size 16. 16. Okay. okay. Cardi, dress it up. Cardi, cami. Okay, really cute. Nice hit crop link for spring. Okay. All right. That's it. Fun weekend, you guys. We'll see you tonight. We'll try to do some stories at the meet and greet. Um, hopefully you can be there. I mean, if you're local, I know many of you are far away. And um, don't worry if it's raining. Although we won't have a, we have a really fun activity, which I'm super excited about. Um, but if it's raining, um, she'll be there. It's, we're not out in the open. We're at a restaurant covered. Same thing with the sample sale tomorrow. Get here early, stand in line, bring an umbrella in case it's raining in the morning. But the, you'll be shopping indoors for that sale. Oh, you're trying to ask, I know you're anywhere on the button up bra, hem, denim, shorts, same situation. We have two or three, two pairs of shorts. Um, that are hung up in the delay of boats at the port. We have hats, our India hats and our India clutches. All of those have traveled literally around the world. I think I'm gonna change their name to around the world clutch and around the world hats because they were supposed to be here, same thing, end of March and they had to take a route to the Suez Canal. Disaster. Um, so we have more stuff coming. We are launching every week. There'll be a launch every week through mid late June, then probably every other week into July, and we are just gonna transition you straight into our trans fall, which is so crazy to think about as I was here. Okay, have a fun weekend, you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for staying on for like an hour and a half with me. So we'll see you next week. Bye-bye.